Hello guys, today in this video, I'm going to show you people how to use a temporary meal or a disposable meal. Many of the time, uh, what happens is just to see something, you want to log into a random website, but they doesn't allow you to get inside until and unless you give them your Gmail or personal Gmail or email. But most of the times we doesn't at all want to give our personal Gmail to random websites like that. So today I'm going to give you a solution for that thing. How to bypass this uh, like mandatory Gmail if they ask. So as an example, today I'm going to use a website called Quora. You people will be familiar with it. Uh, it can be any website, but uh, just it came to my mind first. So I'm going to show you in the website Quora. So whenever uh, like you can see, if you try to enter Quora, there is no skip option and you can't just get into Quora without giving your email or until and unless you make an account on it. So uh, now I'm going to show you people how to bypass this uh, step. So first what you have to do is, so you can see there are there is a login option and a sign up. So if you have an account, you have to log in. Otherwise, you have to sign up with email. Uh, Google or Facebook so which selection uh, which option you have to select is sign up with email so select it so they will ask you for the name and to give the email so as an example I am going to put the name as A B C D but obviously I don't want to give my personal email so now I will show you people how to get a temporary email so the next website we are going is temp mail can see in the address bar tempmail.org so yeah already they have given an email but i'll just refresh it so for refreshing you have this is the refresh oh, sorry for refreshing you have to just press once the delete one so they will give you a uh, new email you could have used that but just for the purpose i'm just uh, deleted it okay you got a new email so what you have to do is here so here you can see this is the email which you got now and it is a temporary email it is it can be only used for max to max 10 minutes and uh, like once you refresh it or uh, like once you delete it you will get a new one and this will be completely gone so it's a disposable mail so down you can see this is the inbox of this email so i uh, without wasting any more time i'll show you how to get into the website so you have to copy this email go there and paste it here so after pasting put next so they have taken the email without any problem and they are asking you to enter a code which has been sent to the email so they have sent a code to the email so that code was uh, that uh, verification code where we look at is in the inbox of before nothing was there here but now you can see there is a email which has came this one Cora. so press on that there you can see the verification code so i'm just going to copy the verification code from here and just going to paste it back here so they are telling you to put a password so randomly i'm going to put a password so i put out a password So as you can see guys, I have, we have successfully bypassed uh, the uh, website without giving our own personal email. So just select it. See as you can see, I have already entered Quora with the uh, disposable email or uh, one use email or temporary email. So you can see uh, my account has been created ABCD. Now without any problem, you can use the website. Like they won't ask you to uh, log in also and you don't have to give your Gmail for that purpose also. So that's it guys. I hope you guys like the video. If you like it, please like and subscribe. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.